other than skin cancer, breast cancer is the most common cancer among American women. On average, every two minutes, a woman is diagnosed with breast cancer in the United States for a total of 250,000 a year. 42,000 of them will die from breast cancer. So screening mammography starts at age 40 for women. But women should always be aware of the, the feel and the, the look and the shape of their breasts. Um, so that should start at age 20. Dr. Saldana says mothers and daughters should be having the conversation frequently. It's a topic that shouldn't start at the doctor's office, but at home. And for men, the conversation is rarely discussed. Most male breast cancers are diagnosed when a man discovers a lump on his chest and the cancer has already progressed to later stages. You know, there's no real screening guideline for men. We, we really try to emphasize the importance of high risk and low risk and risk being what's their family history. Men and women should know their risk factors, meaning their family history, and also be checking themselves each month. High-risk men should be tested at age 35. Having a family member diagnosed with breast cancer qualifies a person as high risk. The earlier stage that we can catch it, uh, the better chance for survival and better prognosis for the patients, whether you're a man or a woman. The bottom line is get your testing done and get educated. Knowledge is power, and when it comes to breast cancer, early detection could be the difference between life and death.